Well, good morning. Welcome to Chasing Chunks TV. I'm Johnny Tosh, and once again, you join me in the fishing man cave, bringing you, the viewers, and my subscribers, a featured look at a new set of scales from Sabre. Now, I've recently purchased these for £27.95. Yes, £27.95, these retail at, and for that price, I think there ain't a better set of scales on the market at the moment with some of the features that this boasts now before we take a look at the actual scales it'd be greatly appreciated if you subscribe to my channel just down in that corner little red icon click on that and yeah if you want to get notifications as well just underneath this video to the right you'll see a little bell icon click on that and never miss another video from me again so let's run this intro let's take a look at these cyber scales let's have a look at some of the features and i think you'll like what you see so run the intro and let's get on it well let's be honest us carp anglers at the moment have never had it so good because there's a couple of companies out there at the moment that are bringing out good quality products at a very reasonable and sensible price. Cyber Tackle being one of them. And after going on their website, having a look at some of their range of fishing tackle, I spotted the digital scales. And knowing that I needed a set, I purchased these for £27.95. My old Nash scales, which I've literally owned for an eternity, have seen better days however they are very heavy and bulky and i know i wanted something with a little bit more compact design digital scales fit that perfectly and uh yeah these dropped through the door the last couple of days and i thought you know what i'm going to get the cameras rolling and show you some of the features that these have got because i think you will be impressed so let's have a little rundown and uh, i'll tell you uh what i do like about these Firstly, again, that compact design with heavy duty folding handles, which we'll take a look at shortly. Clear LCD display, which is a must really. You want to be able to read it nice and clear and you want a nice big reading there with a good backlight, especially in the low light conditions. And also when you're getting old like me, obviously having something a little bit clearer makes everything a little bit easier. Weighs up to £110, though I'm never going to catch anything like that, I would prefer more than less. And knowing that I've got it covered, if I go over to France or go over to Europe and um, fishing for really big chunks, then having more is definitely worth it. One touch, zero push button. Again, I like simplicity and being able just to click on a button, zero the scales is another useful uh, feature stowaway hook stores heaviest weights auto shut off after 60 seconds again that was a big selling point because if you've used any of the old fox digital scales you'll know they never had a shut off on there they was a royal pain in the arse you come to weigh your fish realize that it'd been knocked off in your bag and you would be stuck without a working digital set of scales so you had to keep turning the batteries around just to uh, make it turn off and yeah it wasn't the one so i would definitely look for something with an auto shut off and again these fit the bill battery level indicator in case it's getting low and just at the bottom it says it requires two AAA batteries well i can confirm they actually come up with the batteries included so taking a look at the scales themselves, you'll notice that I have actually purchased the additional pouch for $5.99. This is just to give it a little bit more extra protection as I'm using it on and off the bank and in and out of my bag. The scales themselves, as you can see, are very compact and small, fits in my hand. And uh, with these two heavy duty metal fixings, then you've got that o-ring at the top for using your way crook or obviously your way tripod and your hook at the bottom for obviously weighing your fish now going on to one of the big features on here which are these folding heavy duty handles 
to allow you to uh, weigh your fish and uh, pick up your fish without having to use this o-ring on top you've got a plastic pin there which fits into the body which secures it into place for when you're folding it up i will say that plastic pin i think over time will definitely wear away and you're going to have a few issues with that securing into the body if i was saber and you was looking to develop it further i would definitely say try and use magnets on the actual handle and on the body to save any wear and tear so going on to the actual display you'll see how very clear and very bright that is and if we just give it a second you'll notice that that backlight uh, goes off just to save battery and the only time that it will engage and come back on is once you're using the scales so that's a nice feature that it doesn't stop on and wear your battery down and if I just hold this down, you'll notice that it has held in place and stored your weight. When it detects the actual weight of your fish, then it will actually hold on and give you that reading. The reading itself starts in pounds, goes to pounds and ounces, goes to ounces on its own, and then you've also got a temperature reading on there in Celsius and Fahrenheit. Not too sure why you would need that, but uh, yeah, that feature's there for you to use. And you've also got kg as well. You've also got this one touch zero. So put your way sling on there, zero it, and then you've got 60 seconds to go and get your fish out, weigh your fish, and store your highest weight and uh, get your reading the reason why you've got 60, 60 seconds is you've got that auto shut off feature and it's just to save batteries and uh, once that goes off after the 60 seconds it does clear all the memory out of the actual unit but again it's just a one touch system so uh, you can easily reset it and redo it now the back and the battery compartment is one thing that I wasn't very happy with and the reason being is when you open up this battery case uh, there isn't a rubber seal on the inside of the battery compartment. We as anglers obviously fishing in all weather conditions using these in and around water then I think this is a must of having a uh, plastic seal there so you don't get any water ingression and get no water inside that battery case so yeah that's the only thing that i don't like about these scales and uh but for that sort of price you ain't gonna uh find an absolute perfect piece of kit for £27.95 that is still a very very good buy so I'll probably give you a review once I've used it long term a little bit later on down the line uh, but this is just just to show you the features if you're in line for a new set of scales then Cyber Tackle is probably the uh, company to go and have a look at I'll leave all the descriptions to the website and the place where I went and bought this if you want any more detailed information on these scales then they'll all be in the links below around in the comment section so thank you for watching guys and hopefully you've taken something out from this so it's a bish bash bosh keep tosh wet nets tight lines see you on my next video guys stay safe bye bye